Good evening, Albuquerque Mayor R.J. Berry says cops need to work better with the community they serve. So today, the city announced it's creating citizen groups that will work with neighborhoods to address concerns, problems, and figure out ways APD can help. News 13's Catherine Mazzone is live at APD headquarters with the details. Catherine. Jessica, Mayor Barry says he's been talking to community leaders, families of police shooting victims, and officers wounded in the line of duty. He says success for APD and the city begins with a good relationship with the community. The mayor is creating six councils, one for each of APD's area commands, that'll be made up of people who live or work in each area. Mayor Barry says APD officers will also be part of the councils. You can take concerns to council members who will also be going out into the community to get feedback. The groups will take all of that into consideration and make recommendations to the chief of police on what they think should be done. Mayor, Mayor Barry says the chief will then take those ideas into account when setting new policies. This is not an event uh, going through this process of community policing. This is a process and it's going to take months in years to get where we want to get, but what we're trying to do is get these foundations in place. Community leaders on hand for the mayor's announcement say this doesn't just fall on APD. They think it's a two-way street. The community has to improve communications with officers and have more respect for APD. It just tears me apart when you hear parents telling their kids, don't call 911, you need to fear the cops. That is not the way to go. Uh, we need to we need to make some significant improvements to uh, uh, get rid of that uh, attitude. So how do you become one of these council members or a member of one of these councils? Rather, you can apply online. We have that website up at KRQ links at krqe.com and council members will be chosen by neighborhood leaders. Jessica, back to you. OK, Catherine Barry says he hopes to have these councils up and running by July. He wants to take information gathered by the members and use it in the city's meetings with the Department of Justice.